Hey guys, uh, hello world, welcome back to our platform. This is ABJ from Convenient Technology Lab, your C Tech Learning Lab. And today I'm going to be showing you 12 useful comments for Windows. If you are new here, please subscribe to our channel to receive more video. We're on the waste of time, let's jump right into the action. Okay, guys, so we are moved to our desktop, and some of these comments must be new to you guys, but we have to move on. And all our comments are going to be issued from the run dialog box. So we are going to hold down the window logo key and press R. So coming up at number one on our list is window logo key plus R. And if we do that, our first command will be display DIS uh, PLAY is display switch S W R T C H and just press enter. So what this does is I pop up the connect to a projector. The first command help you to connect to a projector. So as you can see, we can connect to PC, duplicate, extend, and PC has a second screen. So if you issue the command display switch and you have any error message, then it means you have to install your display driver. So we move on to the next command. That is our second command. So we hold down the window logo key and press arrow. We get the run dollar bus again. And this time around, our command is S T I K Y N O T. And what this does is that is it's almost like a reminder. It's pop a pop a little uh, sticky note where you can write something and read me on the screen until you can remove it so for example i can say uh i have i have a meeting with confident technology okay tomorrow at 10 a.m Okay, so this basically is almost like a reminder. So the second comment is uh, S T R K Y N O T E. So you can uh, just tap anything in there, almost like a reminder on your computer. So we move to the next comment by holding down our Win local key and press arrow. It pop up the run dialog box, and our next comment is D X D X D R A G, and press enter. So uh. What this command does is a, a, a download set tools for the DirectX. It collects the basic information about your computer, the primary basic information, and show you them. So as you can see, we got our current date and time. We got a computer name that is desktop. We got the operating system. So it basically brought the Windows 10 Pro 64-bit operating system and also tell in tell you the built-in number. And as you can see, the language is uh, setting to English, and it will also pop up the system administrator or the manufacturer of the system that is Dell Incorporated, and the system model is Latitude E6420. So the BIOS version, as you can see, default system BIOS, the speed of the processor, the RAM, the page file, and the DirectX version. So you may not have the exact same deal incorporated or latitude, but it's going to pull out the basis information of our system. So if you take the next, that is the next page, then it's going to take you to your display drawer, your sound card, and your import, and that is it. So that is the third command. Then move on to our fourth command on our list. So hold down the window local key and press arrow. And the fourth command on our list is uh, some kind of importing because S D or C L T. So what basically this one does is create a backup. So uh, it help you create a backup in your computer. As you can see, create backup. So you click on uh, set up backup, and this may take uh, up to a minute to load. And after you have created a backup process you can connect uh, the external draft you don't create backup on a scene hard disk draft so if you have an external draft you can 
attach the extended drive and take next or select it from the previous or you select it from the one listed or you can save this back up to a, a network so uh, coming up at number five this is very important this is an important one so we say we know error and this is PSR so what this command ready does it help you to recall or uh, every step you made in your computer it's almost like a important for those who create like handout stuff so if you say PSR and OK you got a kind of or recording step recording will pop up and then you can take start uh, a record so if I hit the start button and say MS Word and click on MS Word you can see the uh, little pink uh, bob on the cursor so now if I say uh, welcome to e -L -C -O -M -E, welcome to confident technology la pure and assuming that I highlight them so as you can see highlight them and change the font size the font tab the color and if I say pause or stop record and it put up the steps so basically this is why it does as you can see we got step number one when I click on the start button when I locate and click on war when I enter war and, and, and click on the blank document when I went in war for the very first time the cursor of blinking tab work on the confident technology and the formatting step went on and on and on so basically what this does is very important it help it's important for those who uh, create uh, maybe like handout or want to record every step of what they uh, are doing on their computer so uh, we move on to the next command that is uh, command number six so it's window error and this is very uh, useful too but it's like kind of popular so it just is OSK and what it does it, pro it bring up the on-screen keyboard so some of you guys who will be having trouble with your keyboard maybe one or two keys are freezing you can tap this command OSK and press enter it will pop up the on-screen keyboard and maybe you can use it if you are using a touch screen then you can just tap or you can just use whatever you want so move on to our next command that is command number seven and we know R and this is MRT so what this does is like this is very important okay Microsoft uh, have a built-in software that is used to scan all malicious software removal so MRT and press enter will open the Microsoft or uh, malicious software scanner remover and you can take yes and I think basically you have to connect to the internet or you just take next and as you can see it's going to or it's not going to connect to the internet so it's going to scan you can get a quick scan or full scan or constant mass a scan and what this command will do is like a Microsoft or uh, malicious software removal built-in tools we scan your whole entire computer and look for that uh, dangerous manager software so we move on to our next one and this is uh, another one that is important and it's called CH okay a error in AP is character map and what it does is put up a list of characters that is no command that cannot be issued easily easily by the keyboard so if you take ok as you can see it will bring up a box of or symbols or some people call it characters you can see but of different different kind of symbols that is not easily tapped by the keyboard so if i want to take this one i just click on it and click select and then copy and i can move the wall and just uh, paste it in word as control v 
and you move on so uh, this is kind of important for those who are uh, read maybe in different different languages or different language or you want to use any special characters okay so move on to number nine and number nine is kind of familiar that is C A L C and it's called calculator so if you tap or uh, C A L C in the wrong dialog box and click on OK it pull up the calculator from your computer so as you can see this is scientific calculator you can take the standard form or you can go back to scientific calculator and also program programmer and scientific engine that's that's that is just the news so we move on to the next one that is we know Aaron a p p do you as dot on cpm so what is uh they come into a, a almost like uh i and remove program or only store a program so basically if you're having trouble on installing a program you can just tap app do it as a and click on ok it's going to take you to uninstall or change a program and then you can click and uninstall any program of your choice and we move on to the next one that is uh, also important is TSK MGR and that is a tax manager sorry TSK MGR that is a tax manager so basically what the tax manager does is like or it will call any program that is running on the computer mostly within the operating system that is processing so sometimes if you have a message saying the program is not responding or why is not responding and my face bacon is not responding or photoscape is not responding you tap this command in a run dialog box and you can basically click on it and take in tax and then it's going to close that program for you so uh that is the uh that was the level command then coming up at the last but not the least and this is very very simple and you just we know uh r c o n t r o l and then it's just control c o n t r o l and then it's control so what basically this one does is open the control panel and this is voila so if you move to the control panel you can uh, change view by category or install a program look at the mass feature okay so guys this is how we come to the end of this video i hope this command will be useful to you even if you news one or two but if you have uh, any other useful window comments that you know please also leave it down in the comment section below and thank you for watching our video don't forget to subscribe to receive more videos and bye bye for now